What's up guys, Until Nick here, and welcome back to our Let's Play, um, Yoshi's Woolly World. In the last episode, we did the first half of World 2, which was 2-1 to 2-4, and we used the Sonic, uh, Yoshi Amiibo. Now I'm gonna be using the Captain Falcon Yoshi Amiibo, and, um, yeah, I got this uh, recommended actually by one of my viewers. But yeah, if you guys want to see uh, a special amiibo used in this game, let me know. I already did Sonic. I did Yoshi. Or not Yoshi. I did Sonic. I did uh, Link. And I did Mario. And now I'm doing Captain Falcon. Which is a pretty cool Yoshi. I like Captain Falcon. And... Just like last time, I want to get through this fast. Like, we. I just made it with, uh. Again, my capture card. Uh, whenever. It goes, like. Um, after, like, 35 minutes, it makes it into a separate video. And then I have to. Wait till the two videos. Um. I have to wait till the two videos combine together, which takes a long time. And wow, I actually got that on my first try. Alright, so first we have the We already have the uh the flower and we also got the first yarn bundle and we got the second one too. Already on a roll. Showing me showing you guys my moves just like Captain Falcon does and right here we have the wonderful Pochi who's probably one of my favorite Yoshi characters well I mean there aren't really any Yoshi characters other than Yoshi basically right, so I have to break that in order for him to jump across but whatever way you're facing with Pochi he will uh, he'll go and also destroy some things don't know how to get that one I feel like I forget I don't know how to make Pochi jump actually but can I go oh wow did I just hit him all right let me just I don't really care about the the, whatchamacallit that much the flower all right jump pochi pochi jump jump pochi jump jump pochi jump yay good boy good boy <laughs> ah, he's just so, he's so adorable especially in this game I wish there was an amiibo of him that would have been awesome jump pochi pochi jump I mean he acts like a real dog like he goes wherever you go it's like a man's best friend, just like a real dog is. Jump, Pochi! Pochi, jump! Oh, I guess he can't break them when jumping. Jump, Pochi! There we go. Good boy, you <laughs> Pochi. It's just so adorable, especially in this game. Alright, let me just hit that first. Can I? No, I can't. I think I have to go around. Gotta get... Gotta land on Pochi. And then go over here. And there we go. I mean, he just, he's just so cute. Like, I love him. Can you jump? Yeah, alright. Bye, Pochi. It's kind of like, it's kind of like Yoshi is Yoshi in this game. Like, you know how Mario has Yoshi? Basically, Pochi is the Yoshi and Yoshi, basically. It's kind of funny, but what it is all right did we miss pochi i think we did i think he comes back actually but i missed him i didn't see him though ah so close oh okay there's a platform right there all right nice got the Okay, that was the fourth flower. Wait, how many? Alright, I have three yarn balls. Alright, 
uh, yeah, I think I missed Pochi. Oh wait, never mind. You have to go like that, and there we go. All right, so I'm guessing that's where the fourth bundle is. Hopefully, it's not the fifth one. All right, I'm trying to get through this, but it's actually a bit harder than it looks because they're on stilts, so you can't really like. If I go like that, they'll just bounce back. I guess that is kind of useful though, because I can just go like this. Oh shit! Wait. Okay. Oh wow, the yarn bundle actually is my weakness because like the yarn bundle blocks him like as a shield. All right, so that was the fourth one, right? Yeah. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna try to get the fifth one, and shit, we got Lack 2 here. I don't think you can ride his cloud in this game, though. You know, I mean, what's the point of having Lack 2 if you can't ride his cloud? Also, he has, like, an aimbot type of thing. Damn it, okay, uh. Let me get that. Oh, hey, it's Pochi! Came back. And there we go, we got all the... Let's go with Pochi to the gold pole. And there we go. Oh nice, and we got bonus game. Look at him, he's just staring at me. <laughs> he's just so adorable, like, I love him. And especially, like, in Yoshi's Island, the original one, which was uh, Super Mario World 2. Um, I don't really remember him that much, because I didn't really play Super Mario World 2 that much. I don't really remember him. I think he was only in like a few levels. And I think in this game it's the same thing. But I don't really know. Cuz I remember there's there was this really really hard level in uh in Yoshi's Island where you ha were on Pochi and it was all lava underneath you. So you had to ride on Pochi, but Pochi wasn't as good as he was in this game, where he wasn't as responsive, I don't think. But, yeah, in this game he looks so adorable, and yarn and everything. Like, I really wish that they made an amiibo of him. But they only made Yoshis. And we got a power badge of Pochi, where we can actually have him in any level, which is actually probably my favorite Pochi badge. And... We get a Pochi Yoshi. It's just... I mean, I love how they put... They added Pochi. So you can basically have Pochi in every level. And you can have Pochi riding Pochi. Or Pochi Yoshi riding Pochi. Which is just freaking amazing. I love that. That's just... Alright, anyway. <laughs> Getting carried away. Alright, so here we are. 2-6. Here's where... Desert gets really hot and we have lava all right our, right off the bat we got our first flower all right so the problem with this level is that those things can fall um, on those like spikes which can be really annoying and then we have also these guys where you have to like time your jump perfectly. Okay. Okay, you can't. He stays like in that area right there, but there's more of them in different areas in this level. And if you hit him, he just bounces back a little. Which I mean could be the difference between life and death if you only have like one heart or something. I think there's something secret right here. No? Okay. Ah, shit. And lava's insta-kill. And I thought... I think I just saw a checkpoint there, which even sucks even more, because... Alright, so we gotta get the flower again. Alright, at least I know where everything is, so I don't have to waste time.
Alright, doing good so far. Okay, so up there was actually... Hearts. It wasn't anything secret. Ah, I got hit. Alright. Let's find uh, some secret right here. Alright, we got a yarn bundle. Ah! Basically killed me. Alright. Checkpoint right there. Nice. Hopping shy, guys. Probably don't even need that platform because I have a lot of. Actually, maybe I do because I can just go like this. But yeah, I don't need any. Uh, what's it called? Yarn balls. Alright, nice. Got a badge there. Something secret right there. Right, I'm just gonna take that and go like that. Oh, okay. Shoots up higher than I thought. Alright, something secret up there I can see. And also something secret down there. Alright, so just beads down here. How many do we have? We might actually get a bullet bill Yoshi here. I don't know. And I kind of want to see what it is. Because it's all... It's basically all black. Alright, nice. Third flower, okay. Alright, so we have we have these things from like Damn it. I didn't mean to touch those. I think I think we had those things in uh and what's it called? Uh We had those things in 1-4 or 1-8. I remember seeing those things. Or maybe they're in the upcoming castle. Because I definitely remember seeing those. Alright, so I I'm not going to bother anymore. Damn it. Ugh, thought I had a little bit more invincibility frames. But yeah, I'm trying to speed through this, like I said. Don't want to turn to a separate video and have this, like, be uploaded at, like, in the morning for tomorrow or something like that. And, wow, okay, I can't aim for my life. Alright, so that was a... Wait, did I get the fourth one or no? I don't think I did. I forgot what this is. Is this hearts? I think... No, this is... That, those were beads. Okay, yeah, I remember that. Alright, and then the rest were also beads up there and down there. These were hearts, I remember. And then... Over here is the third flower. And then, what is this, hearts? Okay. And then we also have wait. Nope. No. Come on, I can't. Damn it. I can't aim for my life. I really can't. No matter how. Uh, I want to get that so badly. I, I know it's. Alright, Shy Guy, please. No! Damn it. I don't want to go all the way back. Alright, can I go back and forth? Can I go here now? Okay, I can, so. Oh, okay, thank you. Okay, that's actually nice. Alright, so I got two shots here. And I think the fire blocks it, actually. Alright, well, there goes one shot. 
And there goes the second one. Let's try again. When the fire's not coming up. Okay, come on, Yoshi. Alright, fuck the fire. Alright, back. Alright, I'm wasting too much time here. Alright, this is my last time. If I don't get it, fuck everything. I'm just gonna speed run through it. Alright, there we go. Don't get hit by the fire. Fall in the lava. Alright, good. Right, I'm gonna try to get it. Okay, fuck this. I'm not going. All that for just a flower. I want my yarn balls or yarn bundles. I want to see if that's actually a bullet bill Yoshi. Because if that is, that would be sick. Because like seeing that there's all bullet bills here. And seeing that most of the yarn bundles are black. Alright, all that for just flower. Alright, that's the fifth flower. So that means we're done with the flowers. So the rest of the secrets are probably... Damn, okay, I missed one. It, it could have been a Bullet Yo Bill Yoshi. Because, like, white... There's the white eyes of the Bullet Bill. And so... It could have been a Bullet Bill Yoshi, I'm pretty sure. And I don't remember getting that Yoshi, so... It would have been a surprise to me if it actually was a Bullet Bill Yoshi. Damn, I really wanted to get that. I didn't know what the fourth one was, though. Maybe I'll get it off screen. Alright, everything's free. Maybe I'll get Pochi to bring with me. Actually, no, this is like, uh... This isn't a good level to have Pochi, though. This one's like entering a pyramid and like a bunch of puzzle solving with fire. Kind of reminds me of Legend of Zelda, this level. Probably should have played as Link. Gerudo Valley right here. So you get the cute little theme song. But then it gets remixed into like this Egyptian song. Yeah, so it's basically the remix. It's basically a remix of um of the like main theme song, but like it's all Egyptian. All right, first charm bundle right there. So yeah, the the cool thing about this is that these shy guys, um come back to life they're kind of like zombie shy guys which are pretty cool see right there they come back to life all right, I don't really know what to do here oh there it is yeah even bouncing on them they still come back to life all right so we have to find four keys one in each like area going with the arrows Alright, so there's something down here. I don't know if this is the right way to go or just secret way to get like a collectible. Alright, wow, we already got a checkpoint. So I guess this is the right way to go. Alright, some secret up there. Alright, second yarn bundle? Oh, that was the fourth one, okay. But yeah, these aren't in order, because... I'm probably not doing them in order, since... Like, there's multiple pathways, and you can take them... At different times... Throughout the level. Alright, got flower there. Alright, probably should have saw what's there. Can I go back? Okay, I actually can, but... Okay. I was gonna solve the puzzle first and then get the key, but... Alright, just hearts. That's fine. 
Alright, so what you have to do here is you have to light up all torches. I mean, it's not like hard puzzle solving, but just light up all the torches like Legend of Zelda. Then you get the key. Really? I thought I got it, but... Apparently I have to go back now. Alright, there we go. Now we got the key. Alright, I can't get up there, I don't think. Yeah, so I'll go... I'll go back to where I originally wanted to go. But this time not go through the pipe. Alright, got our first flower right there. Alright, looks like that's the second yarn bundle. Yep, okay. Alright, I have to duck a little bit earlier. Alright, there we go. Get some hearts, I'm guessing. Yep. And go solve another puzzle. That's basically the main thing of this level. Alright, so see, we have one lit. And now we have two lit. This one's actually a bit tricky. Gotta go like that. Then swallow that one. And then go like that. I could have done that in actually two turns, but... I messed up, actually. Alright, so now let's go back. Alright, now, um... Gonna go in the top ones. So, let's... Let's go to the right top one first, and then the left one. The left one's actually kind of hard, actually. Not the puzzle, but like the... Okay, so they can actually die by fire. The zombie Yoshis. Or shy guys, I mean. But yeah, not the, the puzzle's not hard. Wait, what? Okay. Whoa. So I go like that. Wait, what happened? Like, does it... What did I even do? Alright, anyway. But, like, getting to the puzzle is actually hard. Alright, so that's just... Our way out, and also to get a flower, but I don't care about the flowers. Alright, so what we have to do here... Gotta get the fire guy to follow us. Gotta suck up that fire. And then get the wait for another one. Alright. No! Died out. Okay. Alright, there we go. And okay, ah, forgot the key. Damn it. Made that mistake twice already. Alright, got the key now. Alright, now we can get the last one. And that's actually basically the end of the level. Alright, get all these. Surprise the fire doesn't kill you in this game, because, like, you're made out of yarn. Like, you can't really take that many hits of fire. Not to mention just one hit of fire can basically burn yarn. Alright, so here we have, like, these time switches that are also, like... Okay, there's a yarn bundle there. If I can get to it, alright. I'll restart. But yeah, those time switches, you can either step on them for two seconds, like, depending on how long it says, or you can step on them twice. Damn it. Ah, I hit this. Okay, I got it still. Oh, but that was the fifth one. Alright, I think I missed one, but who cares? 
All right, so last fire puzzle right here. All right, so one's lit. Go like that. Go like that. I messed up. Go like that, and then there we go. All right. I mean, I guess it kind of reminds me of, like the spirit temple because like we're in a desert and it's like Legend of Zelda where where you basically lighting torches in order to get the key or the item or something cause like almost every Legend of Zelda game except for like the original had um Lighting all the torches. I think even the original did. No, actually no. The original didn't have torches. Alright, more hearts. Alright, so there's an exit somewhere. Okay, yeah. I think I remember this. So, like... Okay, so... I think it's this one, is it? Nope. Okay, so... That means it must be this one. Like a spring, yeah. Or some- wait. Okay, so yeah, you gotta get like- Okay, I think I know what to do. Go like this. Then- oh, okay. There we go. I think this is the end of the level. Okay. Not yet. Alright, got more gems or beads, whatever you want to call them. Alright, nothing secret over there. Those blocks actually come with you now. More beads. It's usually the last one that has the, uh, the badge, or the middle one, depending on where the bead placement is. Alright, so now this is where our stop is, I think, oh, okay, never mind. These blocks actually come with us now small ones no oh. okay I thought I actually didn't make it that was sucked okay there's a flower there I'm pretty sure cuz we already got the fifth uh we already got the fifth whatchamacallit, uh, yarn bundle. And that's it. Alright, off to the boss room. I don't know how much time I have, so I'm just gonna speed run through it, actually. Cause, like, what I did in the last episode, I went, like, really fast with the first level, but then... Like, I forgot that I had to go fast, so I kept, like, I kept, like, gradually going slower, slower. Then at the end, I was like, oh, shit, I gotta make this 35 minutes long. And I think that said 220 badges already. Just crazy. Alright, so, now we're going to 2-8. What's it called again? I think it's called Bunsen. Yeah, Bunsen the Hot Dog's Castle. So, this is probably the only boss that was, like, shown off for Yoshi's Woolly World. I think it was, like, an E3. Like, the E3 demo. It was part of it. But, yeah, like, 
that was kind of one of my like complaints about Yoshi's Bloody World because we didn't really know much about the bosses until the full game came out. And like I said before, the bosses are usually based off of the enemies and the enemies and boss are based off of the um, the Yoshi that you get in this level. And just like uh, Piranha Plants, you have to first hit him with the Yarn Ball and then uh, jump on him. Alright, so we got a key there. I want to get that Yarn Bundle there. Alright, I'd rather take damage than die, so that was good. But yeah, I don't know. Wait, is that the right way to go? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, uh. I need a checkpoint. Hopefully, this is a checkpoint. Is this the right way to go, or no? No, it's not. Okay. Couldn't give a shit about it. I mean, I could have actually just thrown a yarn ball at it and just get it automatically, but. I don't really give a shit about, uh, the flowers. Alright, I need a. Checkpoint. Okay, uh, hopefully those have hearts. I'm gonna wait, actually. Because I really need hearts right now. And, of course, it's just a stupid flower. And I wish... Like, flowers just don't give you anything. They're just way... Just useless. Alright, good. We got a... Uh, we got a... Whatchamacallit there. Checkpoint. Alright, that's just for the flower. Again, I don't care about the flowers. Where's my yarn bundles? Alright, there's someone up there. Okay. And of course, it's just beads. Alright, there's my yarn bundle. Alright, I'm gonna wait. Alright, there we go. Got the third one. Alright, got some hearts. That's good. Alright, just some more beads. I'll take it. And there's our fourth yarn bundle. I think. Yep, okay. Ah, so close. I want to get up there. Alright, gotta wait for that. Okay, don't get hit. Alright, I think that's a flower actually, is it? kind of like a Donkey Kong Country bonus room basically come on okay just a flower <laughs> I really I don't give a shit about flowers just stop it alright I think that was the fifth flower also so good thing there's mo no more flowers but I'm low on health and I don't want to get hurt secret area Alright, just beads. Alright, give me another checkpoint, please. Come on. Yes, okay. Checkpoint. Alright, don't care about beads. Damn it. Alright, at least I get, what, 10 hearts now? Alright, don't have any yarn balls. Alright, just a flower. Okay, that one's the fifth one then, definitely. Alright, 
Alright, so this is gonna go back and forth, up and down. And then the last yarn bundle is actually over here. I think. Yep, alright, right there. Got it. And now we actually get Bunsen the Yoshi. Which is pretty cool. Alright, I think we're pretty good now. Alright, so now we have boss. And basically all you do is just like those enemies, you... Like, put a yarn... Get yarn around his mouth and then... Like that. And then... He'll like kill himself and then he uh, bounce on his tongue. Like who puts a band-aid on their tongue? Like how do you even do that? Like your tongue's all wet. Like how does that not like... How does the band-aid not like slip off your tongue or something? What does he have like a dry tongue? Okay I guess like... But he's breathing fire too. Like how does he keep that... <laughs> how does he keep that band-aid on? Alright, he's gonna spit fire now, and there we go. So yeah, the only what time you can do it is when he's about to spit fire, because that's when he's not on fire, which kind of makes no sense. I guess, like, he takes all the fire that's on the outside of his body, and, like, tries to put it inside his body, and then tries to breathe out fire, but, like, right now he's doing it perfectly, and he could do that. But, like, I guess he's trying to shoot, like, a fireball, like a projectile. Like, this boss is actually, like, really confusing, like, logic-wise, I guess. And there we go. And, like, if he, if he didn't, like, try to breathe, he probably could have, like, took it off. Like, let me tell you, the boss fights in these games are easy, and they're just stupid. Except for like the final boss and I think one or two bosses are kind of hard and aren't really stupid. Like the last one where we got the guy naked and then he just dies really doesn't make any sense. But I mean this one kind of made a bit sense even though how do you get a bandaid on a tongue and then how do you breathe fire perfectly from the outside but not like it's just really confusing anyway got Bunsen and Yoshi right there and Kamek is out again going to world 3 now so yeah anyway that's gonna be it for today guys thank you all for watching let me know in the comments below what Yoshi amiibo you guys wanna see next I got a bunch of amiibos and let me know which one you guys wanna see next so let me know in the comments below there. But until then, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And stay tuned for more Yoshi's Willy World right here on Tell Nick.